Hey guys, on this quick tutorial, I'm just going to teach you how to transfer files from one external hard drive to another. Same thing if you have a USB drive or even a SD card, same thing. Anyways, um, you should see your external hard drive right here or you can just go into Finder and there you're going to see them on your left hand side. So if you don't see them there, don't worry, just go into Finder um, and up there you guys are going to see preferences. In preferences you guys can click on what to see on your desktop so you can have your hard disks. You can have uh, your external disks which are these so I can just check them on, check them off and that's how you can see them there. Anyways, so right now we have them right here and we're just going to transfer this one right here. So we're going to open this one up. Now this one I named photos and it's the same thing with my other hard drive. I named it photos as well. However, it doesn't have anything in it. And inside photos right here, um, this folder has a bunch of stuff in it. So the easiest way, well, there's several ways. You guys can just right click on it, press copy photos. You guys can press command C or you guys can just drag and drop. So I'm going to do that, drag and drop. So all I have to do is click on it. Okay, hold my left click on it and then just drop it right here and I should get a window in a second telling me that it's preparing the files and then it's transferring them okay so it all depends what type of external hard drive you have um, right now it says that it's gonna take for 300 gigs two hours now that's just because one of my external hard drives is USB 2.0 Okay, my other one's 3.0, so that 3.0 is a lot faster. However, 2.0 to 3.0, it's just gonna go slow. So don't expect it to be too fast, but hopefully you guys are messing around with USB 3.0, which is fast, or even FireWire, which is excellent, and uh, that way things will transfer faster. Now, if you guys can't do this for some reason or having some problems, you guys should look into the format of your external hard drive. So we're gonna do that right now. Um, so this is the easy way of doing it. Um, if you guys are having problems, just go into Disk Utility and look up what format you're messing with, okay? If you're going from Mac and PC, you should have XFAT. If you guys are just messing with Mac, I recommend and highly recommend just having journaled. So I'm gonna click on any one of these Seagates. Let's just go into that one. I'm gonna show you what type of thing this is. Okay, so it tells you that right here. Um, I'm just gonna go into erase. Just because I'm clicking on erase doesn't mean I'm erasing anything until I click actually right here where it says erase. Then you're in trouble because you're formatting and you're erasing, deleting everything from your external hard drive. But that's how you format things here on Mac. Anyways, what you guys want ideally is this journaled. You do have other options such as XFAT, which is compatible with both Mac and PC. So maybe you guys want that. But I recommend making a partition and that way you guys have some stuff that's for Mac, other stuff that's for PC. And I do highly recommend keeping those separate just because when you're transferring files uh, there are problems um, when I say that something's compatible with PC it doesn't make it that's only compatible with PC it will be compatible with Mac the only problem is PC PC will not read your journal okay so with Mac you guys shouldn't have a problem but with PCs yeah they won't read that type of format anyways that's it guys that's how you can transfer stuff from one external hard drive so another, it's the same thing if you're dragging and dropping stuff from directly your Mac or whatever you guys have, an SD card or USB thumb drive. Anyways, that's it. If you guys have any problems, comments, you can write them down here below in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.